What's up everyone? I am so stoked to tell you about our day trip to Anatol. Ant Atoll is something you definitely have to do when you visit Ponape. It's a UNESCO world site and it's located about 20 miles offshore from the main island of Ponape. So to get out to Ant Atoll, we had to start our day a little bit earlier than normal. So we left the dock about 6.30 in the morning. It was such a beautiful ride. The ocean was flat, the sun was out, and we had a few friends join us for the ride. Once we got there, we noticed how low the tide was, and we had planned to dive the channel on an incoming tide, so we knew we had a little bit of time to kill and decided to jump in for a quick swim. After swimming for about 45 minutes, it was time to start our first dive. So our first dive we wanted to do was the southwest tip of the atoll. So once we got on the water, we went down to the bottom and I started getting my camera ready for the dive. And then as soon as I looked up, Maddie was surrounded by a school of barracuda. It was unbelievable. So there were so many barracuda in the school, it was just like a river that never ended. After that giant school of barracuda, we kept drifting along and finding more schools of fish, more barracudas, we saw an eagle ray, sharks, it was uh, unbelievable. After ending that dive, we were so stoked and we still had half the day left to go. So we took an hour break on the boat and headed over to our second site. We headed back over to the channel that we were swimming in earlier and noticed the tide had came up, so we realized that we were in for a nice drift. This channel was filled with hard corals, soft corals, schools of fish, smaller schools of barracuda. It was a great dive. The highlight of this dive is that me and Brad were drifting along and we noticed a manta ray down deep. And on this trip, we were trying to get ID shots and an ID shot is a photograph from the belly down. And that way you can see the spots underneath and that's how researchers identify them. So Brad and I went down and we were able to get some photos and videos of that manta ray. After that manta ray, the current was moving so fast and we just kept cruising along this steep reef. It was amazing. So after that second dive, we headed in the lagoon to have some beers on the beach. So if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. And if you're curious on how to get out to Ant Atoll or if there's anything you think we should experience, go ahead and put it in the comments below. Till next time.